After sentencing, supporters of R. Kelly shouted affirmations to the disgraced R&B star. The Grammy award-winning singer-songwriter sentenced to 20 years for child pornography and enticing a minor, a case possible after victims came forward. It is so critically important to the criminal justice system in this country, and it was critically important in this case in particular for people to come forward and to tell their stories, which is not an easy thing to do. A federal judge issued the sentence after hearing from three of Kelly's victims. A woman known as Pauline during the trial last year told the court today, I've lost so much to this, I can never get those years back. The woman known as Nia said, I felt used, I felt hopeless, and for the next 20 years, I wondered what I did wrong. An attorney representing the woman known as Jane read her statement. During the trial, jurors saw three videos of Jane, then a teenager, and Kelly involved in sexual activity. I think it's very clear that there have been multiple victims associated with R. Kelly. And when you deal with minor children, I don't think anyone is going to draw a conclusion that a child in any way could have brought this on themselves. As for Kelly, his attorney plans to appeal this case as well as the New York conviction. He's pleased, but, you know, we have a lot of work left to do, um, and we're going to do it. And I thank the Lord that they did. And I'm just praying that um, everything go well with the appeal, that he get free. Kelly was also ordered to pay $42,000 to Pauline for cost for therapy. Most of this 20-year sentence will be served at the same time as Kelly is currently serving a 30-year sentence for the New York federal conviction for sex trafficking and racketeering. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.